Function overloading is the most common way of implementing polymorphism. Function overloading can be achieved by defining two or more methods in a class with the same name. However, each method should possess a different signature. This example shows the use of function overloading. Here are four methods that use two parameters each with a return type. Note that the signatures are different for each method, but the function name is the same for all the four functions. The first method uses two parameters, both of type integer, and the return type of the first method is also integer. Now the rest of the three methods will use the return type double. The second function over here uses the first variable as a double, and the second variable as an integer. The third method uses the first variable as an integer, and second as type double, while the fourth one takes both variables of type double. So when the add method is called from the main method, depending on the parameter data types, the respective add method will be called. Thus, the first method call has two integer parameters, and this invokes the add method that takes in two integer parameters. The following method calls the respective add methods. Let's compile the code. The build succeeded. Now run the program. You can see that the respective methods are called depending on the signature of the add method.